Should I have any moral qualms about this? Nah, we're good. I'll... No! Anya failed catastrophically operating on baby Oid. Uh, that's not good. Anya, just, just carry on. You can do it. We believe in you. You're amazing. There we go. Cyber baby. Oh. Oh, the... That's annoying. What should we name little baby Oid? How about Bernard Oid? Happy birthday, Bernard. Well, it's two days ago, but... Happy birthday, Bernard. Here's a bunch of advanced bionics. Just in time for when you're learning to walk and learning how to use your fingies. Gotta start in Marley. <laughs> I did a bunch... I did about three hours of work behind the scenes just so we could get things moving a bit quicker. I've been upgrading a bunch of mechs. Well, actually, I've been upgrading the same few mechs for a long time. I basically stared at Anya, Novium, and Darcy making bionics for... I don't know how long. We put in almost all of said bionics into everyone. We're still not done. I've been doing some work with the genes and the stuff. <laughs> and this is the thing I'm most proud of. A Goduce Mister, a Yayo Duster, a Wake Up Fogger, a Flake Me Upper, and Ambrosia Mister. So whenever... Well, everyone actually is already pretty high. Stella, if you just kind of carry Bernard through there, there, if you just, yeah, you just drop Bernard in the middle of all of that, and now he's, I can't show this on YouTube. <laughs> Did you leave him there? No, you did take him with you. Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> I can't show this on YouTube. <laughs> so Bernard is now, Yeah, I mean, you, I'm not gonna say it, but you can see you can see it here. He's just... He's very happy. That's all I'm gonna say. Anytime anyone runs through here... God, I have a tear in my eye. <laughs> Anytime anyone runs through here, they get... A little hit of... Well, actually, a pretty big hit of Go Juice, Yayo, Wake Up, Flake Me Up... Well, not Flake Me Up. Blake and Ambrosia and uh, since we're very happy about Drogas here uh, Everyone is extremely happy Like look at the mood hundred percent hundred percent hundred percent. It's I, I've never seen this ever before a few things happened well well in the interim ha, Interim dream world. I'm so funny Mr. Darcy was having a mental break, and he became a perfectionist. So he works 35% slower, but he will make things of better quality. Glenn has gotten some tactical bionic eyes. He's gotten an auxiliary brawler chip, which increases his hit chance, his dodge chance. And I also gave him a berserker chip, which we can make him go literally berserk, which I honestly do not dare press this button because he will attack anyone we recruited hunch and hatchrat uh, i'm just kind of making them become better miners and then we'll send them on their way to the mining colony we've got quite a few ancient complexes out on the map i think it's time to do some adventuring go and find us that bloody resurrector mech serum please all right, we've arrived at the first ancient complex. Potato. Oh, oh, I sure hope there wasn't anything we wanted there. Damn, that rocket launch is amazing. The cooldown on it is insanely high, but it's oh so good. And those impact rifles are really good too. Oh, that's a Lucifer bug. That's a Lucifer bug. If they... Oh, okay, thank you, Clay Marumba. Oh, if that would have bitten us, they would have gotten addicted to Luciferium. And that's scary.
They really are a dream team. Tech print. That's good. I'll take that. Infestation happening. Nothing we can't handle. These rifles are so good. Another tech print. Take that. And then run. Nothing more here. Check the ancient danger as well. Anything in that hermetic crate. More tech prints. I'll take that. Brain wiring. Let's open up these caskets as well. I'm feeling confident. A potato. Take something more effective, will you? <laughs> Charge. Potato. Kill that jelly pot. Oh, that was underwhelming. Uh, we've got a legendary grave from the Vikings mod. Let's have a look. While Jules and Potato are walking to the grave, let's go over what we'll do today. There are a few things. I have some final bionics that I want to put on Glenn. I want to finalize Cyber Glenn. I want to resurrect Frorgan. It's already it's there twice now, okay? I want to get rid of some of the mechs because the game is running quite slow and they're all dormant anyway. So my idea was that with these mech upgraders we can make some of them powerful enough that we don't need to have 40 of them or however many we have. Take some focus back on the bees because I haven't I don't think I've even mentioned the bees in a while. It feels like We've arrived at the legendary grave. I don't think I've visited one of these before. A <laughs> war casket viking. <laughs> that rocket launch is amazing. Oh, it's so good. These war caskets are amazing. They're so strong. We got her alive. Götseke Tjelvarsson. An amazing miner. We could have them just study mining and then send them up to the colony. They have a natural passion so they learn super quickly. With the trait too smart and then with the same implants that Potato has. And everyone else. Neuro and Hazer are the muse chip they learn super quickly but first check the rest of this place quite a few sarcophagi and crypto sleep caskets let's see what we'll find here Ida Edhildson 15 mining get her down didn't say take her head and Klaus Kettil Mundberg. Trevligt. Trevligt att träffas. Uh, we got some gold and we got Tjelvarsson. And here we are. The Crypto Bionics. This is what I want to finalize Glenn with. Last time I checked we had like 4,000 plastic. Now we're down to 34. We had so much hops and warp. I just thought I'd put down more fermenting barrels because... We couldn't get rid of it quickly enough. Crypto Bionics. Glenn, we are almost done. Okay, he's got two eyes. He does not have any arms, but we can make him legs instead. The spine, Crypto Core. Is it worth changing out his Arcotech heart for? We'll make one, but we'll see if we'll actually exchange it. Exoskeleton and crypto skin. We will need a whole lot of plasteel for that, so let's get mining, shall we? Here comes Potato and Jules delivering a miner for us. We just need to, uh, well, make them think the way we do. Think in the right way, you know? Potato and Jules, it's time. And bring Glenn with you. Glenn is very eager to get out on the open road. Just look at him. Waiting for a potato and jewels. He can finally go out on an adventure. 
Oh, he's so cute. He's so cute. Potato, let's get rid of these hyenas. I don't trust having them around. They're way too devious. Yeah, that was good. You know what? Let Glenn deal with these. Go get him, Glenn. Ah, uh, it almost bit him to death. Look, it, it did half of his body's damage. In, in just a bruise. Oh, no, Glenn! <laughs> this is scary! Okay, ancient complex. Glenn, you step back for now, please. Infestation yet again. It's going to be very warm in that room for the bugs. Oh, I forgot they can actually walk out through doors. Glenn, come and help. Impact bow. Hmm. Does that, does that mean what I think it means? Yeah, that looks like it's gonna explode. Oh, yes, yes. At the next one, Glenn, you charge in. You're the scout. A whole lot of mics. Glenn, run, run, run. That impact bow is insane. You know what? Maybe not stay in the room that's about to blow up. Potato! Get out of the fire! Alright, good, good, good. What's in the crate? Archive capsules. And that was all there was to it. Well, then we go to the next one. Another one. Glenn, take a peek. Some stabby Roombas. Get him. Oh, get out of there. It's about to blow. Get out of there. Right, Glenn. Potato, hold the door. Alright, what else we got? More mechs. Another ancient complex. Ah, perfect. Alright, get the security crate. Poison synthesis tech print. Binion mob is coming. Oh. A war casket. <laughs> Do you think Glenn could take him? I'm just so scared that if she gets a lucky hit in. Glenn is just gone. I'm okay sending Glenn and Protato though. Charge. <laughs> what? <laughs> Torso, zero out of 40. Seriously impaired. <laughs> Yeah, I think you could say that. That was one of the best things I've ever seen. That was... that was beautiful. You know what, Potato, could you do that again? Charge. Oh, well, I guess you can't do that close range. Fair enough. Oh, Glenn. Get ready by the door. Silent Neuroformers. Uh, I guess we'll take that at least. Hacking the ancient comms console yielded us bee milk. And the ginger gang is attacking. Charge. Get wrecked. Oh, she's actually standing after that. Get shredded. Yeah, you're not standing up anymore. All right, off to the next one. On Bernard's crawling around. Cyber baby. This would be a very weird place to grow up. Oh, Anya's in labor. All right, Anya, push. Push. You can do it. 
Og's there for you, whether you like it or not. Baby D. Animal lover, frail and ab absent-minded. Let's check hybrid baby D's genes. Blue blood, slow disease, is strong immunity, very slow wound healing. That's awful. We can fix that. Uh, hemophiliac, slow runner, dead calm. That's pretty good. Strong melee, robust. Low study is awful. But all in all, it's looking pretty okay. A lot of poor on a lot of things. Poor shooting, poor plants, poor animals, poor social, poor intellectual. Amazing crafting. The slow wound healing is the worst thing, I'd say. Another bust. There is an ancient danger here, though. There's actually two. Alright, let's check them out. No, three! I act surprised, but I made ancient dangers be a bit more common. Because I am going insane. It's been so long. We need... I want the Resurrector mech. <laughs> I, I just love that so much. Come on, Glenn. Yes. Get in there. Open the Hermetic Crate. Lucif more Luciferium. Some Boogs. Tech print for advanced mechanoids. Sure. That's a Siege Breaker. That's pretty, that's pretty strong. Go and execute it. <laughs> He's just so good. Tech print for cataphract armor. I'll happily take that. Mechanoid chips. Sloon and Jaquan are now lovers. Ah, isn't that nice? Jaquan was badly injured in battle. I admire her courage. Alright, the last ancient complex. Come on, Resurrector Maxirum. I want to see Frorgan's face smiling back at me. We've got one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> We've got a hell of a lot of ancient dangers here, as well as the ancient complex. We'll start with the complex. Full disclosure, I've made Resurrector Mech Serum spawn a little more frequently, but there's still not any guarantees. No need to flee, Glenn. You're amazing as it is. Hack the drop supplier, <laughs> and the pod supplier gave us a royal souse. Field trainer in melee. Architect eraser. Glenn. Glenn, where are you? Oh god, Glenn. Uh, save him. Well, I mean... Attack. Get in here. Oh god, that was scary. Glenn is like such a glass cannon. Let's go through these ancient dangers. Bunch of boogs. Oh my god, it's a healer mech serum. Okay, okay. We're <laughs> my heart there. I got so excited for a second. More boogs, like a cornucopia, animal pulser, glitter world medicine. Look at that, Glenn is single handedly taking down a mega spider. Cut off its leg. Oh, he's, so, he's so good. He's so fragile, but he's so good. Charge lance, that's pretty good too, actually. Bunch of people. I mean, I guess we'll rescue them at least. Architect arm, that's good. We'll take that. Okay, okay, watch this. <laughs> Charge. <laughs> When help out. Get wrecked, the mess. Alright, next one.
Glenn! Glenn! Oh god, Glenn. Oh, I'm so sorry. Glenn's body was cut to death. No, why did I send him <laughs> You will pay for this. You will pay for this. Jules, pick up Glenn. If we now find a Resurrector Serum, do we use it on Glenn or Frogan? My brain says Frogan. My heart says Glenn. Okay, so we just cracked up one ancient complex and one, two, three, four, five, seventeen ancient dangers. Not a single Resurrector Serum. We did get a lot of good loot, a bunch of tech prints, a bunch of skill trainers, a bunch of psychic stuff, a bunch of ancient artifacts. We did get a healer mech serum, but no resurrector mech serum. And we did get Amelia, lazy, coordinated and inefficient. So you're just gonna work really slow. Yeah, we'll send you to the mining colony. I will put Glenn at the feet of Frogan. There are now two reasons we need Resurrector Mech Serums. Uh, Raid? Raid, Jaquan? Jaquan, get to cover. Uh, Hatchrat, uh, you're useless. Potato, everybody. Della. Put that baby on the floor. Get out of here. Get out of here. We cannot allow you to live. Binion mob. Tjelvarsson. Götzeke Tjelvarsson. You, my friend, are going to read a book on mining. We managed to get three people captured. One of them dieted it. One of them dieted so we could make a paramedic mech. The other two were actually pretty good at mining. So we're going to be recruiting them. Making them even better and sending them on their way. So I added a mod that makes us be able to craft Healer mech serums. Because I can't take it anymore. I miss Frogan. But most of all, I miss Glenn. Alright, we can do it. We can finally do it. In the mod, the Resurrector mech serums cost industrial medicine and only like 5 Luciferium. I made it to be 20 Glitter World medicine and 75 luciferium instead make it so we always have one in storage but the only two we'll ever use it on is glenn and frorgan it is time to bring him back and he is back he is back my boy min älskade glenn du lever and I guess it's time for Frogan too. We can finally get back on track with our leader back. Pop open that sarcophagus. And he is alive. Don't just leave him there. He is alive. But Wait. He's a waster? Oh. He's a waster. Maybe we shouldn't have kept all of those waste packs in the same... <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't have kept the waste packs in the same room as we did Frogan. His body has mutated. Pollution stimulus, pollution regeneration, pollution rage, sustenance, cognition, numbness, happiness, size sensitivity, accuracy, pollution striding. You've become what you've despised. Yeah, I made that happen. I had the idea, I thought it'd be fun. 
Torgan the Waster. The Waster Supreme. Generally, the Wasters only have one, two, maybe three different pollution um, enhanced things. I I felt I felt it appropriate to make Frorgan the Waster Supreme. Here they both are. Frorgan and Glenn. Best two people in the world. Oh, and Glenn! I have a gift for you. Crypto skin, crypto spine, and crypto legs. Okay, we couldn't install the crypto exoskeleton, which is which is a shame. And I don't really want to change out that. Wait. Oh. The chronic energy produced by the crypto core is particularly unstable. But any harm to the user is easily circumvented by having an exposed porthole that can automatically expel excess energy. This also gives the user the unique advantage of being able to blast any nearby attackers with cryonic energy. That's cool. Frogan is suffering from resurrection sickness. He will be up in about in a day or so. And then you can see everything we've accomplished. But will he like it? Will Frogan like the direction we've taken? Will he like waking up covered in bionics? I gave Haruka some drill arms. They both give 160 plus to regular mining speed and plus 70 to deep drilling speed. She's going to drill up all of those ores so quickly. Raid from the Alliance of Lulzu. Oh, they're coming in immediately. I sincerely doubt you can survive our little area here. But you know what? Give it your best shot. Yeah, you got nothing on us. Oh, Bernard! Did you climb a tree? It would be pretty easy with all of those bionics on you. Masterwork charge rifle for Darcy. <gasps> Frogan's up. Is it everything you expected it to be? Damn it. Okay, so I know that the crypto stuff for Glenn, they actually have usable abilities. But I would assume they don't work because he's a guinea pig. It is time for Frorgan to take the reins again. It is time to begin where we left off. Or something like that. Og, you're not the bee man anymore. But I have a special job for you. You will reclaim the title. Legal custodian. Bernand. Oh, I named him Bernand, not Bernard. <laughs> And I like Bernard now. <laughs> there we go. All is right in the world again. What have you been doing since I've been gone? What is this place in the mountains? What is this luxury? We were supposed to destroy the empire, not become one. Rorgan has issued a decree. Today, the destruction of the Dark Sovereignty begins. Sloon, Darcy, Jules, and Protato. It is time for the reckoning. It is time to rid ourselves from the Dark Sovereignty. Starting with the Esoteric Entropy. Oh, is this all you got? Okay, there's quite a few people here. 14 that we can see. Start spreading out a bit. Potato, use the lance. They do not stand a chance. Sloon, head up there.
They do not stand a chance. Potato. Leave none alive. <laughs> yes. This is exactly what I was after. Alright, what? Jules is fine. Sloon took a crack in his eye by an exploding sniper. Darcy's fine and Potato got got some cracks and bruises. That's all. And we've done it. The first base of the Dark Sovereignty has been destroyed. Very well done, gang. Dars is overdosing out there in the world. Chemical damage in the brain. Oh, that's not good. You know what, since you're out there, destroy a settlement of the trash gang as well. Darcy, you better, you better just kind of stay here. We'll handle it. Hell yes. Potato, charge. Potato, charge. What, will you just charge? Yes. Get him. Leave none behind. Potato. Come on. Will you just okay? Get him. Charge in. You got it. There you go. At another. Come on, get him. Thank you. We got him. We got him. We got him on the run. Flee, flee for your lives. <laughs> Potato. Get everyone you can. Oh, that was fun. Took out a base of the Wasters, took out a base of the Dark Sovereignty. And Darcy died. He did too much drugs. That really is a shame. Darcy was... Darcy was amazing. An amazing builder. Pretty good chef. An amazing Hussar. He just couldn't stay away from the go juice. He was damned if he did, damned if he didn't. Here lies Mr. Darcy. Oh wait, Glenn's not here. He was a fighter. He was a builder. He was a lover. And in death, he will be a hero. I will only add, God bless you. With that, I'll leave you. We had a good day today. We made Resurrector Maxirum. We resurrected Frogan. I'd say Cyber Glen is pretty much finalized, unless I find just one or two extra bionics we can add on him. We resurrected Frogan. Resurrected Glen. It haven't gotten rid of some mechs and have not focused on some bees. But we destroyed a Dark Sovereignty settlement and we destroyed a Trash Gang settlement. So I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Next, <laughs> Frogan. <laughs> Next time, we'll venture out and start dismantling the Dark Sovereignty. Only seven more bases to go. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you all in the next one. See you guys.